Hi, this is Madeline Golick, Pelvic Health Physiotherapist here at Ecophysiotherapy, and welcome back to video 8 of our pregnancy series. I am here with the wonderful Dr. Emily Lipinski, our naturopathic doctor, and uh, this video's topic is about folate or folic acid supplements during pregnancy. Uh, of course, this video is for educational purposes um, and should not be taken as sound medical advice. Um, but let's get uh, started. So, Emily, can you tell us a little bit about what is folate, folic acid? Yes, so folic acid is an important nutrient that many women know and are well aware of. It's very beneficial to take in pregnancy. Okay, um, maybe you can kind of tell us a little bit more about why women are always told you must take folate and you must have your folic acid uh, supplements. Yes, so uh, folic acid it improves overall birth outcomes and health outcomes of the child, but it's also very important in decreasing the risk of neural tube defects. Um, so much so that we have some studies showing that women that are at high risk to have a child with neural tube defect, meaning that she's had two previous children with neural tube defects, when she supplements with folic acid, she's at a 75% less likelihood of having a child with neural de tube defects again. Mm -hmm. And an example would be like uh, spina bifida. Exactly. Okay. Yes. Um, now, you, uh, I've been sort of hearing that, you know, some folic acid um, supplements are better than others because of how we process it. Can you maybe... Exactly. Tell us a little bit more. Yes, yeah, so traditionally uh, women are told to take just a basic folic acid. When they take this form of folic acid and they swallow it, it has to be converted in the body to an active form of folic acid, which is known as l 5 methylhydrotetrofolate. Um, <laughs> for, ba you know, ease, we can just say a methylated form of folate. It's started to show that there could be up to about 65% of women that don't convert folic acid to this active form properly. It's mm -hmm. called um, a polymorphism or an MTHFR polymorphism and their bodies aren't converting it as they should. So even though they're taking the folic acid, they may not be um, exposed to the elevated levels that they should be. So there is supplements on the market now that are the activated form. So instead of wondering if you are converting or not, which you can always get a test through your doctor, um, but you can also just take the activated form of methylfolate so you don't have to worry if you're converting or not. Right, and then both would work um, to decrease the risk of neural exactly. tube defects. Yes, studies show that they still have the same uh, benefit and they're still safe in pregnancy. Awesome. Well, hopefully you found this information helpful. Please take any questions or concerns that you may have to either your family doctor, your OB, your midwife, um, and of course you can always book in with a naturopathic doctor to uh, determine if you are taking the right supplements and if these supplements are right for you. Um, and we look forward to seeing you on the next video. Thanks so much.